Hi, I'm Sandy from Special Fork. We all know we should eat more leafy greens, but sometimes they taste a little bitter and we avoid them. Today I'm going to show you a simple salad, a kale salad, that was developed by Linda Anusasananan, who is a Special Fork food editor. I think you'll like this one. To begin with, we're using dinosaur kale, lacinato kale, but it's called dinosaur kale sometimes because of the pebbly texture, like dinosaur skin. And kale leaves have uh, stems that really are not edible. So what we have to do is we have to tear the leaf from the stem. And what you want to do is a little bit at a time, if you try to tear the whole thing at once, you're likely to go off track. And then you won't get the leaf in one piece like I'm doing. So let's do the other side. And we're taking the leaves. We're going to cut it in half just to make it a little more manageable. And we're just going to roll this up and cut it in quarter inch slices. And we'll take this, put it with the rest of our kale. And now we're making the dressing. Now I have a very big bowl because there's a lot of kale here. And to make the dressing, I'm going to put in some olive oil, lemon juice, grated lemon peel, and sugar, and a little bit of salt. I'm just going to mix this up. And we'll give it a taste if there's enough salt. Maybe just a little more salt. Okay. And we're going to add all the kale leaves. And using clean hands, we want to massage the kale with the dressing to make sure that all the leaves get dressed. After this, you can leave this in the fridge for an hour before you continue, or you can add the rest of the ingredients right now, which is what I'm going to do. Let's get this cleaned up a little bit here. And we're going to add dried cranberries, feta cheese, apples, and toasted pine nuts. I'm just going to toss this together. And we'll be ready to eat. For more recipes and ideas on your smartphone, go to specialfork.com.